So Tedeschi's raised to 36,000 here. Philip McAllister calls out of a stack of 1.74 million. McAllister has the table chip lead, and in this hand, he'll have the advantage of position. He's on the button. I think we've got a decision. <laughs> decision is to call <coughs> as well. Chaya Rava. And that flop is queen 8-4 with two clubs. Looks like Rava has checked to the razor. Makes sense. Sure. A lot of poker the players sit like that. You... Rava calls. That's a call as well. We're still three-way as we go to the turn. It's really interesting. What would he raise pre-flop with, <sighs> not continue, but still call? And I think a lot of times it's going to be hands like tens and jacks. Hands that maybe he wants to take a free card with. I mean, if it's Jacks, he's really happy right now. Yeah, Jack of Hearts on the turn. He's gone from the one arm on one shoulder to two arms on two shoulders. The old water slide pose. Probably learned out there in the water park. Especially as it looks like he's calling. Unless Tadeshi's really strong, I would be shocked to see him over call oh, here. I'll go, go give you the last one now. If he's got a big draw, oh, yeah. he might just Do shove. <coughs> he's raised all in. Well, I think the worst he's going to have here is a monster draw. I still kind of like him for Jackson. I guess Queens is a possibility, too. That would explain why he wouldn't want to see bet because he knows he can't get action on a board like that if three of the four Queens are out. What just happened? McAllister just called. So this pot is huge. 1.1 million in the middle, and Raba still the act. Okay, he well. That's cool, so let's be clear. We have one player all in. We have a pot of 1.4 million. We're going to the river with potential action on the side between the two big stacks at this table. Do these two just check it down? No, they don't. He bets 300? It's a pretty small bet, but I don't see why you would bet here unless you're betting for value. So 300,000 into the side pot. Tedeschi competing for the main pot of 1.4 million. And now, McAllister moves all in. And he's got <sighs> Rabah covered. How does everyone have a hand here? <laughs> I have no idea. But obviously, Rabah has committed most of his stack in this hand. He's got 851k left. Right for a mil. What hand does he think that they could be chopping with? King 10, right? Yeah. I'm saying in this spot. This pot is officially multi-way with Tedeschi already all in. Now McAllister's all in. And if Rubber calls, he's all in. That's more like 1.5 million. Yeah. The table calls the clock soon. I know you're sick, but I'm, I don't know if you're well, that sick. Then. Baffling the way this hand has played out. That's a call. No, it's a fold. Yes. And he likes what flush? he sees. Oh, oh, no, King, straight, King 10 clubs. King 10 of hearts for a royal flush. It is a royal. And look at that. Today she did have a set of queens. What a terrible, disgusting run out for what is going to be the best hand almost always. That's what I, runner, runner, perfect, perfect royal flush. I am trying to remember the last time we saw. I've never seen one. A royal flush in an EPT, let alone on the feature table. That is absolutely disgusting. And a raw flush that eliminates a player who flopped top set. Flop the nuts, lose to the super mega ultimo nuts. So now has 2.7 million. Can you pull the flush or just king 10 of clubs? Sick.